and welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I have missed you all so, so much. Y'all know we've been trying to drop those videos back to back to back. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe and hit that post notification bell so you can be notified every single time I upload a video. So today, beauties, I wanted to come to the Beauty Vending Machine and just have a little girl talk. We are gonna talk about how it is to be an entrepreneur. Um, I have, get Destiny. I was gonna say her name, <laughs> y'all, but I had to, uh, sis is a business owner. So we have Get Destiny. Go ahead and introduce yourself and tell us what you do. Well, thanks, Brittany. Um, I'm Destiny, the Destinizer. Get Destiny by Destiny. Become a Destinizer today. Okay. At the Avion Boutique, which is my salon that I do own. Um, as of right now, um, being a salon owner, entrepreneur, mother, uh, musical artist, uh, a, lot of, a lot of things. That... Right, you wear several hats. <laughs> I'm yes. glad she mentioned being a, a music artist and being a mother because that is that is big and that is like number one, especially when you're trying to juggle being an entrepreneur, a mom, like you're wearing so many different hats. So how I are am. you doing that? You know, um, I'm just staying prayed up, Brittany. I'm staying prayed up and I, I just don't, I don't know. God is just steering me in the right direction in life as far as there's no limit to what I want to do and okay. who I want to be. So okay. I just want to thank him for that. And, you know, with the support of my family, clients, everything just works. It it's works. Just working. It just works. And you have how many kids? Three. I have one son that is deceased uh that's where my salon name came from i'm gonna give you a little background about myself please um, do please do i was in beauty school for a really really long time and one moment i got discouraged i stopped going um to a point where i started doing different fields of work fast food nursing all that stuff i couldn't do it i couldn't do it you're gonna see and they had the white poop and stuff all while you had your beauty license no no, you were going to get it. Mm -hmm. I was in the process of getting it. And okay. I got discouraged and I stopped for about a year or so. But I eventually did go back. Um, had about a year to finish and it worked. It worked out. God pushed me. Um, in the midst of that, I was pregnant with my son. Um, and when I got to my eighth month delivering, um, they didn't think they didn't find a heartbeat anymore. So that was a very devastating thing because I have three girls already. You know, yeah. so having a boy would have been great, but you know, God has other plans for me, so um, I took it as a good loss, you know, because it made me better, it made me go back to school, push forward, and go get my cosmetology license. So I can't complain about anything, I'm definitely more so humble and grateful for God and what He's done for me, uh, and use my son as a sacrifice as far as pushing me forward and being the person that I am today. So I couldn't do it on nine to five. I couldn't Period. do it on nine to five. Okay. That, ain't, that ain't in me. Okay. That ain't nothing that ain't in against me. A nine to five. <laughs> you know, baby steps to get where you're trying to go. Mm -hmm. um, I want to touch bases on what you said. Okay, so you felt like losing a baby, everything was a sacrifice mm -hmm. because now you fast forward, you guys. You have opened your own boutique. Yes. You are writing she's writing music and producing music you guys videos as well <laughs> videos <laughs> she's doing it all on top of being a mom of three on top of you also have your hair care line that you're in the i do of. i do on top of <laughs> like come on i mean the list goes directing on. the so, church you hear me like I mean, you are doing it Thank and you're you. doing it effortlessly. On Ew. top of you guys, she has just lost, how how much weight have you lost? A lot. <laughs> like, since did a total transformation, yeah. y'all. Like, a total transformation and is like literally walking and shining in her light, you guys. So, you know, we, we just trying to tell y'all, if, if we did it, two girls who grew up in church in the hood, <laughs> It, I'm telling you, if, if I could do it, Brittany, I know you got, you got, I believe in you. If myself, if I could do it, 
It's like losing weight if I could do it, doing this entrepreneur thing if I could do it, anybody could do it. That's just how I feel. Y'all, yeah, no. It's a mental thing. It's a mental thing. It is. Yeah. It definitely is. And once you are able to control your thoughts and have control over your mind and what you do with your time, things will begin to change. Definitely. Like things will begin to shift in your favor. You know, a lot of us be feeling like God don't be answering our prayers, but it's not that he's not answering. It's just you aren't in a position to hear him. You, how can he, you know, like, how can you ask something and then not position yourself to hear the answer? Right. You have to already be moving and be in that, you know, in that lane of what you're doing. Exactly. Faith without works is dead. And if you move it in a negative way, you're not going to get far either. Negativity is going to continue to come your way. And no matter what anybody does to you, as long as you just stay humble, stay to yourself, push forward, you know, worry about what you have going on, anything's possible. Anything is possible. <laughs> so, you guys, I'm going to have all of her social media information below. And, again, make sure you guys are subscribed. And we just want to thank you so much. Make sure you get your lashes, your Being lip gloss, beauty. get everything that you need. Visit us at Amazon, Walmart, everywhere you need. And until next <laughs> time, gang, for our next Girl Chat, peace. I love you all. Bye. Be me, beauty. All Period. day. Period. Get your lashes. Get that's denied. Period.